Hey guys, I am back again, and as you can see, I have a ginormous haul for you. Um, it's after Christmas. Actually, most of this I found before Christmas, but after Christmas is one of the best times to dive. Um, just because there's so much holiday-themed stuff that stores have to get rid of. And I am looking forward to um, grabbing some of those, hopefully. I have a few days off of work here, and I'm going to hopefully go out for a full dive route tomorrow we'll see but i have a lot of stuff right here to show you as well again um my house is still a mess <laughs> i haven't put anything away i haven't cleaned up anything um but i am back on the table my project is done i gave it away for christmas it was fabulous um but i have not cleaned up from it so hopefully tomorrow i can do that as well but let's get right into it so right here i have a uh spiral cut double glazed ham and the date on that isn't until February, so I'll open that up and check it out. Make sure it's still, you know, pink and smells fine. But um, I found ham before, and it was just fine, so I will enjoy that. And then back here I have a party tray with the cheese and the meat and the crackers in the middle. Um, the date on this one is, it's upside down for you, but it's not till May. There you go, May 2019. I think it was thrown out because this is um, ripped on the back right there. So, brand new party tray. That's exciting. Two packs of nuts, simple nut blend. Three of these Omega Trail Mix. Well, that one's pro probiotic fruit and nut. Fruit and nut, and then two of the Omega. I have four of these Delicious Steels Swiss Rolls. Nine of these Buddy Bars. These are pretty good. Um, I mean, they're not fabulous, but for a dollar for four twin packs, they're pretty good. And then I have one, two, three, four, five, eleven of these mini powdered donuts. I have three of these decaf McCafe K-Cups. I won't be keeping those just because they're decaf. So I'll give those away. And then I have two Starbucks. One is caramel. One is breakfast blend. I'll end up keeping those probably. But as you can see, I still have a whole stack of the Starbucks double caffeine right there. Down here I have two things of granola bars. Not too crazy there. This is a men's 3-in-1. And this is a um, body wash Olay. It smells really good actually. And then I have a brand new pack of antibacterial hand wipes. The date on these is 1-2019, but I mean, they'll still be just fine. So I'm going to keep these in my car for when I am dumpster diving. But in front of those, I have two things of this class classic almond biscotti. Let's see if we can find a date on these. I didn't look. Um, July 29th, 2019. So those aren't bad. And then I have two giant stacks of Twizzlers. These are Twizzlers Twists. And these are just 10% more, so they're all the twist kind, no, no the pull-apart kinds, unfortunately. I know this is the best one. <laughs> I have this thing of honey. The cap is broken here on the top. There it goes. But the seal is still on there, as you can see. Let me find that. Mm, I guess I'll find it after. I have a pack of Reese's Cups, some organic white cheddar and shells mac and cheese. This is my absolute favorite, the white cheddar with shells. An individual pack of mac and cheese, some... Hearty lentil with vegetable soup, some veggie chips, two of these sun-dried tomato and basil premium mixed nuts, an individual thing of Skinny Pop, two things of albacore tuna. They are dented, but that's okay. And then a bag of Twix that ripped open. I think, no, no, there's more food. I have a uh, one, two, three, four, five of these strawberry bars. That's pretty good. Some Blue Cerna snack shakes vanilla flavor what are these i think when i see these i think of old like elderly people is that what those are for i'll have to look into those but i'm not sure and then cinnamon toast crunch i know that's horrible for you but it's so good that's one of my favorite cereals i very rarely eat cereal but i might keep that <laughs> i have four packs of cough drops they are like herbal sugar-free good stuff there and finishing out the food i'm pretty sure i have all of these aloe drinks um, this says enrich. This says exposed. I'm not really sure what the meaning behind that is, but this one is um, pomegranate cranberry. This one is original honey. <clears throat> so those are good. I have some pills here. Claritin, Claritin, Zyrtec liquid gels, um, some baby or gel, cooling gels. The packaging just got ripped a little bit. NyQuil, Benadryl. I think that's it. And then I have three different kinds of sandwich snack bags down here as well. Hiding over here I have one mechanical pencil with some lead. 
that's a good find. And then I have this really cute little mug. It even has a to from thing on it that says happy holidays. There's no chips or anything. It just looks like it was kind of dirtied, maybe used. I don't know. So I'm going to wash that up. It has a little thing on the inside there too. And keep that in my gift bucket until next year. These are exciting for me at least. Um, I have four of these pure vanilla extracts. They are in there. I'm not sure why these were thrown out. Is there? Well, probably because the boxes got swish, squished now that I look at it. Um, the date isn't until 2021. So those are a good find. And moving this way, I have, I actually found this exact thing last year. It's a remote control car. Um, the box just got a little dirty, but other than that, it's brand new and I'm sure it works just fine. So I will give that away as well. And something super exciting, I have all of these Scott paper towels, 12 pack, but it says it equals 22 and they are all in there. It's just ripped open at the top right there, but that's no problem. Moving along, I have a brand new weighted jump rope, some dishcloths, some rainbow sprinkles, but again, the cap is broken. That's fine with me. Some of these little cellophane goodie bags and some bigger ones back here. A pair of gloves. These are brand new. They just came apart. Um, nice quality glove there. Super heavy duty. A tiny pack of bows. I already used one of those. Some of these cute little bows here. Two packs. And then I have three small bags and two larger Christmas bags down here on the bottom. I have this little mouse. I will give to my mom for her cat. A pack of light bulbs. This was two separate packs. One was broken in each of them, so I just consolidated, and now I have two good light bulbs. Um, a pack of batteries. Uh, yeah, none are missing in there. That's good. And this is exciting. It's like an old-fashioned ceramic tree. I think there's something missing on the top, but that's fine with me. There's no batteries in it right now, but it still does work when you test it with this little tester thing. See? Super pretty. So I will put that away for next year and use it then. Moving this way, I have this word search. Brand new. Um, really like this outer case or the like the the cover of it. And I think I will give that to my sister because um, she flies a little bit more often than I do, like on planes and stuff. And she might be going some somewhere next week, so I think I'll give that to her. And then below that, I have this little book as well. It's taped up. Like that's how it came, but it has little prompts in here, I think. Like there's a coloring page, my favorite things, highlight of my day, stuff like that. So I think that's super cute as well. It said the key to my heart right there. And then this is <laughs> fabulous. This is fabulous. It's um, I'm not big into makeup, but I think I might keep this just because it's so cute. It's a 2019 planner. It is a little dirty. That's why they threw it out. But it does have the wraparound thing to keep it closed. And look how cute it is. When you open it, there's these beautiful flowers on the opening page. And it has, like, it lays the month out for you. And then it has each individual day. So these are already passed, obviously. But um, it goes until, let's see, what month? Uh, December of 2019. So that'll be good for a whole nother year. I think I will end up using that. Let's see what day Christmas is on next year. Oh, Wednesday. I guess we could have guessed because it was on a Tuesday this year. Hopefully everybody had a good Christmas, speaking of. And then below that I have another ream of printer paper. I find this often enough where I have never ever had to buy printer paper ever. And I probably never will because I don't print that much. So that's a good find. Moving along, I have three little tiny stockings. That's my water bottle. No, <laughs> that's not from the dumpster. I was just having a drink. Um, this is a really cute little plate for fall time. There is a tiny chip right here at the top, but I am completely fine with that. I didn't even notice it at first. Um, kind of random here. We're going along in a random order, but these are all little gift card cards. You put the gift card inside and a whole bunch of envelopes. This is a Ray Dunn mug. As you can see, it's chipped right there, but I think with like a flower on the insider, something along those lines, it will be just fine. That was six dollars new. And then right here I have a little thing of soap. The nozzle is broken. I can replace that or um, it still does come out as you can see without it. In here I have a box of just random holiday Christmas cards. Oh and I have, I actually was going to get one of these but it's a key holder. 
I can't open it with one hand, but it looks like a rock. So you put it outside, you have your key in it, so if you get locked out, which I have done before, um, this will come in handy. I have two of these little meow, meow light up headphones. They have little cat ears on them, so that'll be cute for a little kid. And then back here I have this huge, like literally the biggest pillowcase I've ever seen in my entire life. But that's what it looks like. There was a matching comforter in there and actually a whole bunch of stuff. Um, but they had cut them up and spray painted it and everything, but they didn't touch this one, so I took it. And then from that same store, I got this little salt lamp. As you can see, he's lighting up beautifully. They did mark him up over here. That's no big deal. This side, he's fine. Let me turn the lights off just so you guys can get the full effect. Super bright. And then it changes colors. I'll let it change this one. Yeah. See, isn't that cool? So, there's that. And finishing out the haul, I have some really cool stuff from this store as well. This is called Play Tape. It pulls out to 15 feet of, like, track for little boys or girls um, to play with their cars. A dancing dog speaker, Bluetooth. That's cute. I got another one of the, these LED light-up rings. A squishy cheeseburger keychain. I know that's all the rage these days. <laughs> Some matcha green tea Pocky. Um, it's open, but the pack is sealed still. That's fine. Fortnite keychain Raptor. Uh, I don't know if that's a good character, but my boyfriend would, so maybe he'll want that. This Paw Patrol fan light-up thing, and as you can see, it does work. And I think there's candy down there. Some bath confetti. It is broken a little bit at the top up here, unfortunately, but I guess I could use that. This is cool. I don't have an iPhone anymore, but um, for the people who don't have the earphone jack, you plug this in and then you can still charge it and plug your earphones in at the same time. This is another Bluetooth wireless speaker. A little squishy poop. <laughs> Some um, earbuds. This is a little room waterfall thing. That's cool. A sketchbook right here just missing some of the binding that's okay this is a nice little vacuum double wall stainless steel tumbler still has the instructions in there and everything it might just be missing like a closure on the lid right here I'm not sure if it came with that or not um, but for just keeping this at home in the fridge like we do that'll be just fine I think this little guy is absolutely adorable I might put this on my Christmas tree <laughs> Well, I'm going to take my Christmas tree down, but put it on there for next year. And he's just a little, uh, like, squishy hedgehog. And then behind that, super cool, brand new. I don't think anything is missing. It's a Star Wars 100-plus combinations, like, lightsaber blade builder. So, that's it, guys. And it was quite a bit. So, as always, thank you for watching. I'll be back soon for sure, and I hope everybody had a happy holiday and a great day. Thanks for watching.